Hey, what's good? Rockman here, and uh, I'm gonna try and finish off Super Metroid. I may do this in two videos because I realized that I missed a couple of items, and I'm very upset about that. It's kind of why I've been avoiding recording this, aside from being extremely busy. But I'm missing a power bomb. I found the super missile, and I believe I put that into the last clip. But I'm also missing a uh, power bomb, and I'm missing two missiles. But even with that aside, I'm at 239, which is going to make it really, really tight to like try and beat the game under three hours. So what I want to do is I'm going to actually record this in two ways. I'm actually going to go ahead and beat the game as is right now and see if I can make it under three hours if I speed through. <laughs> and then once I do that, I'm going to go ahead and go back and I'll try to get the, uh, see if I can find the last couple things I'm missing and then I'll beat it again. But that I won't show. I'll just show what I'm missing and then I'll come back. I'll cut back and show the uh, final time I got. So I don't know because I'm actually in North Fair right now after I went and got the, I remember the Super Missile I missed. Excuse me. So I'm going to try and see if I can go back and, uh, it's kind of a mess. I'm kind of annoyed by that. But I got very close. I know now I would have 100% the game if I wouldn't have missed two missiles and those other. I don't know how I missed a power bomb. I don't know where I. I don't know how I missed a power bomb. I knew when I saw the super missile was missing, I knew I missed it. That was on the wreck ship. And I'm like, okay, I think I'll get that one. But the power bomb, I'm pretty sure the one I'm missing is in Norfair because I think I know where I missed it at. I could go and try and get it now. I'm going to try and get it. Actually, since I'm here, I'm going to try and get it on this file, but I can't even get 100% anyway. Um, no, I won't. I'll take that back. I'm not going to do it. I'll do it on a separate file. I'm going to try and book it over to Criteria as fast as humanly possible and see if I can't still beat this game within, uh, I guess I got, what, 20 minutes, basically? Which I can do, but I don't know how strict the game timer is towards that. And I got to do a lot of running, because where am I at? Um, not really. Not a lot of running. Enough running, basically. Oh, Samus, don't do this to me right now. Can't afford to play around. We gotta, we gotta book it. We gotta book it, girl. Also, I am playing with the gamepad right now, which is gonna be a little different. So, yeah, I'm gonna try and book it back as quickly as possible. If I can beat this entire game in 20 minutes, that would be beautiful if I could do that. Um, I wanna go here, actually. I think the faster way up to get out of here and get back to Criteria and back towards where we wanna go... Um, what am I trying to get to? I'm trying to get to. Uh, I'm trying to think the faster way. I thought maybe cutting through my radio would be faster, but I don't think it is. I think this has to be faster where I want to get to, actually. Because I can just go through there, cut up. Yeah, I have to go through what's next. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? This is going to be faster. Go straight through here. Should not take me that long to get up here. Oh, come on now, Samus. Now you're just... Now you're just playing around. You're trying to add tension. That's not necessary. So we've gotten pretty much everything. I said, I'm one power bomb... Whatever. I'm one power bomb short. Um, And I'm two missiles short. I know the other missile is at. It's in Meridia. There's one... Actually, there's one in Meridia and there's one in another spot. But I'm not stressing it right now. Like I said, I'm going to see... I'll do that in another... Uh, I bet to the other file. I pretty much copied my file just so I could see if I could make it in time. I didn't. <laughs> Going to get the Super Missile kind of added a lot of time to me, so or to my clock. So I just want to get the best ending. I want you guys to see the best ending is all it is. Oh my goodness! I really should not play the game pad. Right? I'm so used to playing this with fast controller. It is messing me up something fierce. Why am I playing with the analog stick? That doesn't help either. Alright, so I need to go here. Okay, I can't run through that good. I may have taken a little... No, this is the quickest way. This is the quickest way. Considering where I was at, this is the quickest way. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to rush them to make dumb mistakes now. Come on. We got a whole area to go through. And I gotta wait for Oh man, okay. I'm gonna cut this close, like super close. I have to make sure I make the battle with a uh, final boss like really short. <laughs> I cannot play around that battle. 
All right, so we are here. Okay, good. That was really good. And if I go through here, yes. So open up this earlier. All right, here we go. We are headed toward the final area. Oh, I love this part. We've beaten Creed. We demolish Fantoon. We executed Dragon. And we destroyed Ridley. Let's look at my recording time. We're already five minutes in. <laughs> I'm gonna try to make it in the 20 minutes. Come on. This is a very long sequence, actually. This does not help my game time at all. Like I said, I'm not sure how accurate the game clock is compared to, like, actual time. Alright, let's see. Like, I don't know if it counts as elevator sequence and stuff. I don't know. I'm gonna find out, but we're gonna burn through this area so fast. We are in New Torian. I'm not gonna... Oh, wow, that was... Alright, let's just walk off the platform. <laughs> Alright. Hey. You know what? Give me one second. I'm going to switch uh, controller methods because this is not going to work for me. Okay. Here we go. I need you to not do that. There we go. I had to go ahead and grab the classic controller again because that was not going to work. Gamepad did not feel right. I'm, I've gotten too soon. CC again. No, don't waste super missiles. Can't afford to do that. So yeah, Metroids. I didn't even explain those. Yeah, Metroids for those that are not aware and have been under a rock. You have to freeze them and shoot them with either five regular missiles or one super missile. Um. Oh god. Okay, here we go. They're actually not that threatening in this game. In older games, they were like, uh, or they can grab onto you and do that, so I like taking life. I fell in the lava, that's not good. As soon as I open my mouth, I get attacked by one. Hey, you wanna get off me? You wanna get off me? Hi, stay there. Good. It's called the Rock Nin Opens His Mouth Syndrome. Whenever I open my mouth, something bad's gonna happen. <laughs> I'm going to curse myself. That's what I do. I know it's broke, but hit me, I didn't care. I don't care. I don't care. Yes. And then we're in. Hey. Hi. Can't kill these. I don't know why you can't kill these, but you can't kill these. Apparently they are, like, vital to survival. I don't understand. Oh, Grace, another Kozo stat. Oh. That. That's pretty ominous. Hey, Scree and her... Oh, uh, Ripper. Oh, uh, this looks... This looks promising. Boss? Holy mother of God. Yep. Yep. Um, hi. Well? That's... That's a big Metroid. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, you really can't do anything about this. <laughs> You're stuck here. Help me! Why did it stop at one? Oh, it's the baby Metroid. What did they do to you? Yeah, so it's the Metroid that uh, we failed to rescue. I'm not sure what they did to it, because that is a huge Metroid, but, uh, yeah. Fell up one missiles before. Fell up a life. Powerful. Alright. Oh, man. Yeah, that thing got huge. That, it's been eating its, uh, eating its vegetables. And by vegetables, I mean living organisms. So, Ghidorah right here, then. You can die. I like it. Oh man, 
It's that time. That's a save. We're not gonna save down here. I'm not gonna waste my time with that. Get super missiles ready. Actually, no. Use missiles. Oh wow, that was bad. Save my super missiles for a specific purpose. Yeah, so this is a pretty much for anybody that knows Metroid lore or have seen the Metroid games or some intro of this game, this is pretty much a repeat of the area from uh, the final area from Metroid 1. Uh, I don't really care, you guys are doing no damage, I have a gravity suit. Come on. Stop it. I'm actually making this longer than it needs to be. Come the hell on. There we go. 11 minutes. Alright, not too bad. <laughs> uh, I see it. How much of this runs with the game clock? Dude, dude. It's literally. Hi, Mother Bray. How are you doing? Good. That's good. Eat all 30 super missiles because I don't have, I have no use for these. I like these missiles since they are so powerful. They take a lot of her life down very quickly. Hey. And then missiles are just easy to fire, so I'll just use those up. Pretty soon she should be getting pretty pissed. Uh, that's a lot of missiles. There we go, she's pissed. Hi. I, I see you shoot those beams. Take an entire energy tank, just so you know. Just so you're aware. I'm not gonna dodge. I don't really care. There's a specific method to my madness, though. And there we go. And things are gonna go south. Take a little damage. Take a little damage. Normally, I would not do this, but I'm trying to be this as fast as possible because I'm so close to running out of time. We're being over three hours. I gotta be a little careful. All right, that's close enough. Maybe one more hit. That should be good. I don't think I'm gonna die. I do that right? Yeah, okay, good. Should make it get back up. Alright, there we go. Yeah, it's, this is the cinematic part right here. So, pretty much, those beams that, uh, I guess, hyper beam, you can't, you can't evade that at all. You, you have to take that hit. Get up, Samus, you're gonna die! Oh, yeah! Guess who's back? My baby! Baby came to rescue me. That is a cavalcade of colors, by the way. God, I love this scene so much. This is old school cinematics. <laughs> Before you got FMVs and whatnot, it was like, oh, just use the in-game sprites. That simple thing, but it's so good. So good. Hey, it's still breathing. Um, no. Stop, stop attacking. Stop hurting my baby. Don't, don't hurt my baby. Stop hurting my baby. Oh, poor baby, don't. No, no, baby, don't. Don't do it. I'm okay. Don't. Let's go. And it's the easy part. Pretty much you can hyper beam and just rock the head. You can just rock the head. I shouldn't get hit. I'm getting hit though because I'm recording. As always. Pretty much this is the thing I like about this battle. I don't know if it's intentional or not. But for me, this is kind of like it seems like it's like a take out your frustration battle because it's nothing. Mother Brain can't do anything about this. You just get to rock your head back all day. And just like kind of the visceral feedback you get from just rocking the head back. <laughs> with, that, with that hyper beam. Yeah, you went down, you went down. Oh. Door explosion. Oh, I might do this. I might pull it off. I might beat this in less than 20 minutes. And of course, because it's Metroid, 
escape immediately. We have three minutes to get out of the entire, like, Mother Brain wasn't playing a lot of time. Last time she destroyed, like, her base. This time she's like, nah, this entire planet is going. Everything's going down. Everything's going down. Is this the room? I knew it was. Yep. Don't hit me, you bastard. And this when we fall down, we gotta platform our way back up. Yep. I'm not going to. I'm gonna. Oh, I get hit by that. That's lame. They make go all through here. I'm gonna stay as much to the left as possible. This is very hard to see in, by the way. I don't know if anybody knew that. It's extremely hard to see in this crap. <laughs> Rip through them. Oh, what? I didn't get speed boost. Oh, that's not good. That's no bueno. This is when wall kick becomes even nicer than space jump. Because you can just wall kick up here. Oh my god. Don't fail now. If I was close to the top, apparently I wasn't. Alright, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. I have time, I have time. We're good, we're good, we're good. One we're good. We're we're golden. We're so golden. I believe the lava is still rising in this area. Yeah, the entire place is just mother brain's not freaking around anymore. She wanted to go all out this time. But we're gonna do something else. Oh my goodness. Now my first time doing this, I didn't know what to do in here. I didn't know I could even come in here. I just was like, wait a minute, let me just try going down here. I just did it randomly. And I thought I was stuck in here. I didn't realize you could open that up and save everybody. Anybody that watched the Metroid Fusion run through or knows about Metroid lore in general or has seen Metroid Fusion being played the millions of times seen on YouTube knows those guys are very essential to the storyline of Metroid Fusion. So I'm assuming that that means that her rescuing them on this game is canon. Canon. Nick Cannon. Alright, cool. We're out. Get, get in the ship, Sam. Sam, let's get in the ship. So let's see, I made it. Okay, that should be under 20 minutes by a lot. Let's see what happens. Let's see what the, the game thinks. Oh, man. We're leaving that planet surface. We out of here. And if you look closely, I think it's to the right. As it's exploding. Or after it explodes, not as it's exploding. So we see Samus' ship just spinning out of control. We should, yep, off to the right, you can see it. There it is. They escaped. The operation was completed successfully. Clear time 252. And in the fantastic end credit music. Oh, man. So I actually did manage to beat that under three hours. I was actually very scared when I saw that my time was 239. I can be the way quicker than that. I thought I was, but I probably took a little bit more time since I was explaining things and making stupid decisions. And the fight with Ridley went on way longer than it really should have. But, yeah. There it is. Super Metroid. I love this game. I love this game. I love this game. It's one of my top ten of like all time, which regularly rotates. But this is one of the ones that usually stays in it. I mean, this game when this game was announced, I remember the EGM I got that had this game on the cover, and just looking at the design of everything from there, having not played it before, I wish sometimes I wish as a gamer, especially as a retro gamer, I could go back to a time when I hadn't played most of these games, where I was still, where I wasn't as cynical or like. As, um, as spoiled as I am now as far as gaming is concerned. It just goes back to the times where I hadn't played this game before and this is like my first time going through it. You know, it, it, I wish I could relive those days sometimes, but you can't. You can only really just go through and say, hey, let me share this experience with somebody else. So, I know this game has been played like a bajillion times on YouTube, but I figured it'd be... Like I said, somebody suggested it to me, it was Darkfire, he was like, hey, you should play Super Metroid, and I said, sure, I plan on it anyway, and I figured it'd be a quicker playthrough, and I could just 
knock it out and it'll be fun. But it was it was really enjoyable to actually record this all the way through this time. I did it on my like I said my stream a while back, but yeah, this this is always just a great game. And I remember just like opening that EGM being like, yo, this looks like it's gonna be fantastic. It's gonna be so fun. Oh, I can't wait for this game. And my first time playing for this game, I think it took I wanna say ten hours. On my first, on my original card, I, that, that file is long gone because I've beaten the game like a bajillion times on that same card. But yeah, I, ten hours. Like Metroid games are short once you know what to do. They're very short and sweet, but um, they're extremely rewarding once you get to that point. We can do it in like under three hours, under two hours, under an hour. Me personally, I prefer to do it without any kind of. Uh, What's the word? Sequence breaking. Ah, uh, there we go. That under three hours finished, we get to see Samus Air in, in a weird bikini. Those 1990 graphics. Oh, my goodness. Collecting items is 97. That's actually considering that's not bad. Considering I'm missing the power bomb, missing two missiles. It's not very bad at all. But there it is. And see you next mission. Yes. So there you have it. Super Metroid. I've droned on so long, long enough about that. Um Hey, if you have not played this game yourself, highly recommend it. Highly, 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 highly recommend it. Fantastic, fantastic, classic game, and I had fun doing this. So, if you enjoyed it, please leave a comment or a like or whatever. Whatever you want to do. Me, I am going to probably get back to playing Pokemon pretty soon because I have to finish that too. And yeah, I will probably be putting up a couple of clips after this to show the stuff that I'm missing. And go from there. I really have nothing else to say, so I'm going to stop talking now. Take it easy. Later.